Good morning, learners. Let's today's lesson be a reminder of how we can keep our body healthy. That will be followed by how we can maintain our body system. Firstly, we have to have a goal of what we want to achieve in order to maintain our body system. And that will be followed by how we plan ways of achieving those goals. Lastly, we have to get a positive result from what we have been planning. Perhaps some of you here are familiar and know these terms and their actions as well. Terms such as fitness, flexibility, agility run, cardiovascular, push-ups, press-ups, pulse, and sit-ups. I have some videos with me that will give you an insight of what we have been discussing. I know that when you watch these videos, you will ha you'll have an idea of how different activities are approached by different genders and that will give you an idea, and that will motivate you to participate more in different activities. Now that I've heard your prior knowledge on the physical fitness world, to make sure that you really understand, I have set up a physical fitness challenge in order for us to practice what we have been discussing. There are several components at which we can determine our physical fitness well-being. But before we can get on into the action, it is essential to begin with stretching to avoid hurting our muscles and warming up to activate our reflectiveness. I have set up four stations for participation. Four people are allocated in each and every station. It is a partnership activity. All stations ex exercise their different activities at the same time. And when we are done with your activity, you move on to the next station. I'm your timekeeper. All activities are done in 60 seconds. Remember partnership. When your partner is on the action, you assist with recording their score. Body mass index is a measure of body fats in your weight in relation to your heart and applies to most adults, men and women age 20 and over. For children age 2 and over, BMI percentile is the best assessment of body fats. BMI is calculated by dividing your weight in kilograms by your height in meters squared. Enter your measurements below and click calculate for your body mass index and some action you can take to reach and maintain a healthy weight. No, underweight and extremely underweight, it is when you consider to be low, too low to be healthy. No man, it's when you optimally healthy. Overweight, serving more body fats than it is optimally healthy. Obese, excessive body fats. According to a chart, it is advisable for a person aged from 2 to 12 to weigh less than 50 in relation to their height. From 13 to 19 to weigh 40 to 65 kilograms in relation to their height also. And from 20 and over, they may weigh from 60 to 105 kilograms in relation to their height. Before we conclude today's lesson, we have to do a task that will indicate to us that we are now familiar and we are understanding what we have been discussing throughout this lesson. So the task that I have allocated you with is to complete an easy worksheet whereby you will be meshing column A and column B of these terms and meanings 
of them as we've been discussing throughout this lesson. And you have five minutes on doing so. Learners, now that you have done today's lesson, but before I let you go, just for the last five minutes, I want us to give feedback on what you have been doing today. After that, then I will be able to assess as to how much you have grasped on today's lesson. And then you will be able to ask questions. Your peers will be answering so that I can know how much you have understood on today's lesson.